See here a pipe 20 centimeter long is closed at one end that means that an example of the closed organ pipe which has which harmonic mode of the pipe is resonantly excited by a frequency of 430 hertz source. So, frequency is given this will the source be in resonance with the pipe if both the ends are open a speed of sound is 340 meter per second. So, see here in case of the closed organ pipe the fundamental frequency for the nth mode of vibration that is given here nu n is equal to 2 n minus 1 into V upon 4 L, V is the speed L is length and n is the number of modes. V n is given to you 430 is equal to 2 n minus 1 into V is given here 340 speed of sound and 4 into L is given to us here 20 centimeter so that is 0 0.2 meter. So, when you solve this thing you will be getting here 2 n minus 1 is equal to 430 into 0 0.8 divided by 340. Now, you solve it and get the value of n. So, when we solve it we can get 2 n minus 1 is equal to 1.02. So, 2 n is equal to 2.02 .02 and we can get here n is equal to 1.01 .01. that means first n equal to we can take 1. So, we can take here the first normal mode of vibration here, but if it is suppose open from both the ends then what will be happening here and what will, will, will there be in resonance condition or not. So, let us see let us see here when the both the ends of the pipes are is are open. So, now see here when both the ends of the pipes are open then the frequency can be written nu n is equal to n into v upon 2 l. We can write here 430 is equal to n into 340 divided by 2 into 0 0.2 and we can get n is equal to 430 into 0 0.4 divided by 340 that will be coming as 0 0.5 but C or n has to be integer. So, obviously, if a n is not coming an integer it means there is no resonance condition found if both the ends of the pipes are open. Now, see here find at what temperature the velocity of sound in air will be one and a half times the velocity at 11 degree Celsius. So, velocity at any temperature T is equal to given to you V naught under root of T upon T naught that is here V naught 273 plus T divided by 273. So, now see here at 11 degree Celsius we can get V 11 is equal to V naught under root of 273 plus 11 that will be getting 284 divided by 273 by putting here T is equal to 11 degree Celsius. And at what temperature? So, find at what temperature? So, we can get here V T V naught into 273 plus T divided by 273. So, at temperature T this velocity is V T. So, now V T is given to you one and a half times of the velocity at 11 degree Celsius that is 3 by 2 of V 11. So, we can write V naught under root of 273 plus T divided by 273 is equal to 3 by 2 v naught under root of in place of v 11 I am writing this value 284 divided by 273. So, this and this will get cancelled and we can solve it here. So, we will be getting in that case 273 plus t divided by 273 is equal to 9 by 4 into 284 by 273 this and this will get cancelled. Now, on solving this equation just to cross multiply and solve it you will be getting T is equal to 360 degree Celsius. So, you can solve this equation easily there is just you know addition and multiplication and just you will be getting the answer T is equal to 360 degree Celsius.